Today is important, so I want to dress accordingly. This is my Trail Ninja Hen hoodie. And especially important are uh, uh, what kind of socks you wear, because you stand on them. And standing on someone means it's your basis, it's your foundation. And so <laughs> socks are important. So I first thought I'd take Batman socks, but let's say no. But let, let's leave, leave them out. Oh, yeah. I mean, sausage socks. More Batman socks. Hmm. Ah, pirate with polka dots. This is another good... Okay, pirate with polka dots is definitely another candidate. So we put the candidates here. Uh, no, no. Superhero socks. I don't want to wear them out, but I showed them to you because they're great. They even have a little cape, so when you run, you can extend your cape and swish or uh, fall over it. <laughs> I don't think I want to have just simple stripes. These are winter socks. They are pretty thick. I don't want them either. Ooh, since when do I have boring black socks? So what do we have here? The pirate flag. Ah, it's a Snoopy. Yeah, pirate Snoopy. What do you say? Pirate Snoopy? No. Ah, I love the socks because I love the color. Uh, tropical socks. Tropical banana socks. No, a Snoopy. No, these are Loch Ness socks. Great, right? <laughs> But do I want to wear monster socks? Maybe I want to wear monster socks. Ah, classical Superman socks. But honestly, Superman, Superwoman. Poor. I wore them before on an important occasion and they helped pretty good. So I do them in, the, in my maybe pile out of appreciation for their former oh, alpaca socks. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. No. Ah, where are my unicorn rainbow socks? I mean, I have uh, even cactus socks. No. No. Wow, that's pretty ugly, but uh, sometimes you need <laughs> pretty dark socks. They have just a flower pattern. Oh, not a Snoopy. It's pretty hard to do socks without <laughs> with one hand. <laughs> ah, is this my rainbow unicorn socks? I mean, are the yeah, rainbow and are there unicorns on there? No, uh, but just rainbows are pretty great, right? Maybe not for the current occasion, but I think I will... I will need them soon. Pirate, monster, superman, let's say superwoman, and sausage. Okay, and rainbow. I believe these are the last exciting socks. Kagadu socks, but not the right occasion. I mean, we have enough. I've got some kind of monster in my flat which eats socks. I believe it's pretty common. I believe it's not a spe specific to my flat. I believe it's more a global, a global monster. Rocco and his modern life, or however it's called in English, thinks that it's um, a function of the washing machine that it eats socks. And I believe that's pretty possible. Hey, let's go with the sausage. You can never go wrong with with the sausages, right? I need writing socks. I already designed writing socks, but they are so expensive. So <laughs> I haven't bought them. Maybe I'll do a Kickstarter for them. Please sponsor me writing socks. <laughs> I need them for important chapters. <laughs> A great idea. <laughs> Today is important and exciting and I'm totally scatterbrained. 
and I phoned with a few of my friends and couldn't string a coherent sentence so uh, I'm sorry for you <laughs> and I don't know if it's so intelligent to record this in this state but I want to I want to lock my progress in my vlogs the day that I will finish my book at least the first draft is pretty important oh dear yeah um i invited myself to lisa daily's live stream for today we have now 1 p.m oh i don't know this p.m and a.m crap the thing of afternoon <laughs> so around one in the afternoon and her live stream is at five in the afternoon local time drum time and i spent a lot of thoughts about how much i prepare if i just leave open the last sentence or if i should leave open the whole last scene and i don't even know what would be the last scene i love to have banquet like good food good company exotic drinks yeah uh, i like it very much in um, asterix and obelix the comic and i like it in harry potter as well it ends with the end of year banquets or end of year celebration with the last of the house points redistributed and an extra 200 points to Gryffindor. <laughs> but I think the really, really last scene should be something introspective. Maybe Flora in her jacuzzi thinking about the things. I mean, I have really no reason to make Banker scene at this point. It's just... I, I like banquets <laughs> and there will be a few problematic people on the banquet so this might be too much for and too problematic for the last scene hmm. the time is getting nearer and nearer and nearer and whew, I shouldn't do this right switch camera angles <laughs> during the recording this can't work well at all Brain yeah wish empty. me luck Brain i link empty. the live stream to lisa Ooh, and i record another bit when it's finished i finished it i finished my book auntie toasts the we are mmorpg oh that's great i mean i'm so tired i'm so tired because it was way too exciting today. I was scatterbrained and excited and anxious and oh. But now that I'm finished, I'm taking a break and I will go to bed early tonight. I wrote the last few words while on the writing sprint with the lovely Liza Daly, the story detective, Carol Brown and Sari Wright's books. Nearing the end, nearing the end. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who's got it? Me, 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 me. Yes, yes, me, me. Finished, 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 finished. Yay! So I get in a quick costume change because special occasions want special equipment. Okay, right, everybody. <laughs> right. I was like in the middle of writing and I looked up and saw um, Joanne's chicken costume and I about <laughs> fell out of my chair. <laughs> uh, yes, 
I finished my novel. I was so <laughs> happy. And I saw my chicken costume and said, yes, yes, I need it, I need it. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> so awesome. It's oh so my exciting. god. I even I even dance for you. I do the chicken <laughs> dance for you. <laughs> <laughs> we all have to do the chicken dance. Yeah. <laughs> And it was so nice of them to let me join and I enjoyed it so much that I could share my joy. So the whole week was hoo 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 and I did um, some animation projects for ATTB to distract me <laughs> from my fears and anxieties and I wrote very much. I uploaded it to the NaNoWriMo page and I hadn't realized how much I wrote. Yeah, And I had to check on the stats of last week if I really wrote um, five uh, chapters and uh, yes I did. <laughs> Maybe it were four chapters and a bit but uh, wow I mean I yeah <laughs> I worked hard and that's good that's good. So next week I will take it easy. I don't know when I start revising. I want to start immediately, yeah? But many writing advice books and many people say, ah, just let it lay there for a while. And the people on the chat um, in the live stream said the same thing. Mm, take it easy and with more distance you see more uh, things and you see them more clearly and I am I believe they are probably right but I believe I can do some continuity errors and formatting things um, I want to fix them this is a long overdue like I part different skill description with a line of dashes and this line is a different length in every chapter <laughs> so I want to have it uh, the same length in every chapter and my writing style evolved and I believe I got better and more secure and I know more stylistic uh, methods like I didn't know about filter words when I started uh, writing so the small things yeah it's not intelligent to start with the line editing part before the developmental edits but I will do it <laughs> because I need feedback for the developmental edits and I can't present my story to my beta readers with known errors. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's kind of logical, isn't it? So I just do a bit of editing and see how it goes and of course start book two. So that's my plan for next week. But of course I will do nothing today <laughs> but edit this video. I don't write. So that's it for next week. Uh, welcome to two new Patreons. Complaining helps. <laughs> I complained a lot about my sinking Patreon patronage and uh, great, <laughs> two more joined. Uh, I hope you enjoy being in the chicken coop. Bye bye.